This is how you fix Streamlabs not showing full screen. Fixing Streamlabs not showing full screen is crucial to ensure that your viewers can see your content clearly, enabling an optimal viewing experience during your live stream. Now I'm going to show you how this is done. It's actually very simple. So I have here my screen. I'm just going to enable this one. All right. And as you can see, it's not showing the entire screen. So what you're going to do is just right click it All right here. And then you should see this one here, transform. We're going to click reset transform. All right, there you go. So you can see that it is now in its full screen. Now let's try to go back here. I just press control Z to undo it. You can also right click this one here and you're going to click transform. You should be able to see here fit to screen. You can also do this one and it will give you the same result as we had earlier. Now that's another problem. Now the reason why it's happening is probably because you have stretched it just like this. So see that I'm stretching it. Yep, there it goes. So I'm stretching it so much that you can see that it's not showing the entire screen anymore. So that's probably what happened. Now let's try to go back here. We're going to reset transform. Now another reason why it is happening is probably because you have accidentally cropped it. So maybe this is what happened to you. All right, just like that. Um, yeah, basically you can do that one, but it's still the same. You can just go ahead and click reset transform and everything should be okay. Now I did that by just clicking the alt and then dragging this one here. So basically this is how you're going to crop it. Now you can also press the shift and then, oops, All right, there you go. Press the shift and then basically drag this in order to kind of like stretch it. You are just stretching it horizontally or vertically. So that is what is happening. Now let's try to go back again, right click, and then we're going to hit transform. Now, this is also another thing that is happening to you. Go ahead and click the settings. And then we're going to go and click video here. You have to make sure that base resolution and the output resolution is the same. If not, then what you're going to do, say for example, if you're streaming at 4K, mine is just actually at 1080p. So say for example, if you're streaming at 4K, what you're going to do is that the output resolution, say for example, if your internet is not that strong, so you're just going to set it at 1080p. Now the downscale filter is where you are going to have to play. So say for example here by linear, as you can see, it is the fastest but if we're talking about scaling then it is a bit blurry now you have to make sure to try this one here this is Langsus and as you can see it is sharpened and it has 32 samples the problem is that it is a bit heavy so I want you to try between Bicubic and Langsus and see which one works for you. Another thing is the common FPS values. I set mine to 30 because I'm not playing game. But if you're playing game, make sure it is at 60. And yes, congratulations everybody. That is how you're going to fix Streamlabs when it's not showing your full screen. And by the way, I would highly suggest to upgrade to Streamlabs Ultra to level up your streaming quality and experience. You can save up the $10 of discount right away after clicking on the link in the description box and the comment section below. And as always, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and leave this video a like if this helps you out.